Hey everyone, we are going to go ahead and assemble a birthday present for my aunt and I'm also making her a wreath so stay tuned for that video. But now let's put everything else together. So I have these canvas garden gloves and I'm just going to face them inward like this and I'm going to make a cute little roll with them. So I'm going to roll them up tightly tuck in the thumb a little bit which tends to jut out and then I have cut a piece of jute twine that I'm going to tie it with so I'm going to wrap this around a few times and then I'm going to tie a little bow but hold on I'm seeing a problem There's a piece that didn't get tight, so I just need to adjust this one second. It got stuck on each other. All right, so once that's all straightened out, now we're just gonna tie a little bow. and then just snip the end to make it even. Okay, so there's that presentation. And then I'm going to pair that with these two beautiful seed packets I have. And then we're gonna pair both of those things with this ultimate gardener book. So I'm just gonna kind of present everything together and then I'm going to place them in an extra large cellophane gift sack that I have from a privately owned dollar store that I haven't uh, been able to go to because they haven't been open with everything that's going on. But anyway, I love having these on hand Smaller than a basket bag, bigger than a loot sack. They're just perfect. So I go ahead and place that in there on one half. And then I'm going to bunch up the top and also secure that with a piece of jute twine. And I'm just going to take a couple of pieces of scotch tape to make that tighter on the sides. Okay, so that's this part of the gift. And then we are gonna move on to the second part of the gift. Okay, so it's gonna involve these two from Dollar Tree, the slumber set. another extra large clear gift bag and I'll be using this tissue paper and I really like the patterned one because it reminds me a 
of almost like a water type of pattern. So I'm going to start off with the patterned one. And I'm just going to fold it in four equal to make a perfect square. Okay, open up that clear bag and then place the tissue paper down at the bottom flat. We're going to try to pull up those corners. And then I'm going to place the two bottles right down there at the bottom standing up. And if you recall, I bought this bath scrubby from Dollar Tree and I said I love how the color matches with these bottles and makes a beautiful set so I'm pairing it with that placed it in the back standing up like that and then I'm going to go ahead and tie this shut with some silver curling ribbon I cut a few more lengths of that to add some extra curl. Okay, so we go ahead and tie those on. We'll curl them last, and now I'm just going to fold the sides back, secure them with tape to make the whole package tighter. We go ahead and curl everything to make it look pretty. And now I've chosen to use the solid blue to line the gift bag to put everything in. All right, and there we have it. Now we go ahead and put our two little bundles into the gift bag. All right, so this gift is done. 
this part and I still have to make her her hula hoop wreath so make sure you stay tuned for that video now let's look at some Father's Day gifts okay so I have these two little briefcase looking boxes from Dollar Tree one is bigger than the other one so one is for my uncle slash godfather which is the smaller one and one is for my stepfather so inside I have placed this men's grooming kit all of this is from Dollar Tree and then the Dove Men Plus Care Lotion and the Bar of Soap and a Gillette um, deodorant and a Gillette Invisible Spray. So I'm just going to put those in there like this and I'm not even going to wrap it or add any tissue paper or anything. So this gift will be just like that. And there it is and I think it's absolutely beautiful now my stepfather's is the bigger one it contains all of the exact same stuff the only thing that I am adding are these wood grained sunglasses and they actually fit in the box as well that's why I chose the bigger one for him and that's it done so there are their two gifts beautiful and simple so boom Father's Day gifts done for those two men. Yay. All right. So that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed just a little bit of gift ideas and gift assembling. Stay tuned for that wreath video. And until then, stay blessed, my friends.